You know, isn't it great um, not being a YouTube shill and just being able to upload videos even after you just uploaded one because something interesting happened and you just felt like talking about it? So um, MAME261 came out today, and the really cool thing about it is that uh, Oliver uh, Gallibear, or however the fuck you pronounce his name, uh, that fucking genius, you know, who did the uh, 68K weight state emulation, and basically he's doing most of the inter interesting shit in MAME now. He emulated the Yamaha MU50, which, which, which was a really popular uh, MIDI device um, that came out in uh, 1994, and it's very similar to, you know, the, kind of the, the, the Roland, you know, sound canvas shit, very, very similar sounding. And I want to show you the cool shit you can do with MAME, and you can check, um, you know, the, below there for all the links, you know, if you want to, you know, fuck around with this shit. So, um, there's a program called uh, Loop MIDI, and basically what Loop MIDI lets you do is um, it lets you create, essentially, um, a, you know, a MIDI loopback so that... Um, you know, different uh, you know programs on your computer can actually communicate with each other. So, so for example, um, we can create uh, a new MIDI port. Um, you know, you know, you know, like that, right? Um, and then add it. Okay, so so now so now we have this you know virtual um, you know MIDI loopback, and so so what we can do is. We can um, tell uh, Mame to uh, you, know, you know to take this uh, you know MIDI uh, you know as an input, and then we can set another program to use the MIDI as an output. So so we can actually run native PC programs like Doom and um, send you know like the the, the, the MIDI uh, to. Uh, uh, you know, MAME's emulation and actually get the audio out of it. So I'll show you how to do this, how to do the, the command line. So um, basically what we'll do is we run MAME. We're going to say MAME and then we're going to, you know, do so, so, you know, like, yeah, that, that MAME developer, I mean, he actually, you know, you, you know, it's really running this thing's real firmware and everything, you know, and with the, you know, reverb effects, you know, it's like the real deal. Yeah, it sounds pretty fucking good. So, so we're gonna run the MU50 device, and then we're gonna say MIDI in is um, this thing, and run it in windowed mode. And so, oh, you gotta love that nag screen. Thanks a lot, quad damage, you fucking cocksucker. So, okay, so now, so see, we're actually getting the. Um, you know, the, the, this this device is, uh, you know, output there, okay? And so, but I mean, and because we're not sending any MIDI to it right now, nothing's happening. But but, but watch this crazy crap, though. So, so while this is running, now I'm going to launch Doom. And, and I want you to compare the difference in the audio when I change this shit. Like, first we're going to run just, like, some, like, shitty, um, you know, you know built-in, um, uh, you know, software a MIDI thing. Okay, so watch this when I change it.
So in any case, you get the idea. Um, pretty fucking cool. We live in pretty fucking amazing times when you think about it. I mean, this this got me more erect than pretty much any commercial game that came out in 2023. It's pretty fucking impressive, man. And I, I'm so looking forward to the day that MAME emulates the, um, you know, Sound Canvas 55, um, you know, other, other shit like that. Because I said, I mean, really, MAME is legitimate for this. It, it's, it's a really legitimate use case for MAME, you know, using it as, you know, a MIDI... Um, uh, you, you know, in point there. So pretty fucking cool. 